Procrastination has been the slow killer of dreams since man was created on this earth. And whether you are a preacher, teacher, the average Joe, or a billion dollar entrepreneur, we are all guilty of this fact. We have all fallen short and struggled with simple daily tasks at some point in our lives. Procrastination is the bad habit of putting off until the day after tomorrow what should have been done the day before yesterday. The more time you have to do things, the less you are able to get done. The greatest thief that this world has ever produced is procrastination, and he is still at large. Welcome to Success Diet, the show that educates, motivates, and inspires. Here, we cover topics that will help you in your business careers. Our mission is to give you all the knowledge necessary for success. By now, you've already figured out the topic for today, how to eliminate procrastination. As our boss, Miklos Clark, loves to say, fear and procrastination are best friends, and their sole mission is to cripple your dreams. This statement is as true as the sun rises in the east. Miklos is an avid entrepreneur himself, and he's managed to grow several businesses from nothing into million-dollar businesses and I know he didn't do it procrastinating. Hey, don't be a procrastinator. Tap that like button as we achieve success together. One, the number one way to eliminate procrastination is to set goals. Goal setting is as important for success as oxygen is for life. As the famous quote says, if you fail to plan, you plan to fail. Two, Eliminate distraction and use visual reminders. We live in an age of digital distraction, and it doesn't matter where in the world you live. If you have a mobile phone, chances are you are addicted, and addiction is more like the reason why you keep putting off the minor goals you set, not to mention the major ones. With the rise of technology, we are constantly bombarded with the news feeds, text messages from our friends and colleagues, photo and video alerts from famous influencers. What we don't often realize is that in the time we waste looking at someone else's success, we are losing time that we could be using to create our own success. Do you see what I'm saying? Make a list of all your daily tasks and start with the hardest. Let's pretend that the hardest task is the giant Goliath and you are David with the slingshot and stone who's going to slay the giant with the first shot you've got but if you hesitate, then the giant will trample you, and then all your dreams will be no more. Now, I don't have to tell you what move to make. Success is just like David and Goliath. The moment you decide to put off your task for the next hour or day, you've already lost the battle. Number three, and our final note about procrastination, is that habit is key. Build good habits, habits of completing what you've started, there is a chemical in your brain called endorphins, and it's that good feeling you get whenever you've done something good like completing a task. The more you achieve, the more you'll want to achieve, and soon it will become reflex.